We were one of five kids who grew up with the same mom and we had five different dads. And our mother would just abandon us for weeks or months at a time with really no parent. I mean, we had to steal food to eat. We did our best not to, to make sure that nobody ever found out how we were living because we were fearful the authorities would come and take us away and separate us. And so I share with them what we had to do to stay under the radar screen, how we needed to educate ourselves because we weren't in school often and how we managed to self-educate one another, how we didn't give up because we had each other to hold up. We never looked at ourselves as having pity for ourselves individually because we were all too worried about making sure everyone else was keeping their heads above water. We did our best to isolate our younger siblings from what it was that was really going on. We, we created these fantasy world. We, we created homes everywhere we would go, even though we'd live in the back of a car, we'd make it like a home. So um, we weren't too concerned about um, them being depressed and being held back because we did our best to insulate them. Her memoir talks about her experience as a child growing up through the foster care system, through being homeless in Manhattan and the Hamptons, and all the way to her political career and who she is today. For those students who are here who are struggling, who it's very hard for them to even attend class because of a lot of other factors going on in their outside life, or who are here but don't know if they're ever going to be back next semester because of financial obligations or family obligations or just emotionally where they are, I just want for them to get that all they have to do, they don't have to make big goals in life, they just got to get through college. They have to make a promise to themselves and wake up every day, get out of bed, put one foot in front of another, and figure out what your goals are going to be that day, and just get through that day. And at the end of the night, you would have been one day closer to your goal. And if you do that every day, ultimately, you're going to get where you want to be.